Yes, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? This is What's On Jones coming right back at you. Pro wrestling related topic video. And you know, I want to talk about a certain situation with a certain legend that got fired. You probably heard that by now. You know, I literally just heard um a while ago. And this, that's the police, they're not here for me. <laughs> but yes, Hulk Hogan has been fired from the WWE. I am really shocked to hear about that. That was the last thing that I was expecting to wake up to in the morning was to hear that Hulk Hogan had got fired and for a reason of being racist. Racist. A couple of racist slurs that Hulk Hogan had made apparently years ago when he had his whole sex thing or his whole little sex tape thing going. He made some racial slurs saying things basically like the N-word. You know, nigger. That's what he said. You know, nigger. Um, something about, like, like Brooke, like, not sleeping. Like, his, his daughter, Brooke Hogan, not sleeping with, like, with niggers or something like that. But basically, he was saying the word nigger. And that has suffered on the internet, more than likely. And WWE got wind of it, so they fired Hulk Hogan immediately. And when I heard this, you know, I was, I was a little shocked about that. So, you know, the N-word... Probably the most controversial word in the history of the planet Earth. And th th there's two ways you could e use the N-word, in my opinion. There's the racist way, and then there's the slang way. You know, like, like people will use the N-word as a slang. You know, black people do it. Um, Hispanic people do it. You know, sometimes white people do it. Um, You know, hell, I've, I've seen Hispanic people call other Hispanic people, you know, the N-words, and I've seen black people call Hispanic people the N-word, but Hulk Hogan was most definitely not using the N-word, you know, the slang way. He wasn't using it as a slang. He really wasn't. He, he most definitely wasn't. No, he was using it as a racist slur. He even said that, yeah, he's a little bit racist. And when you say that you're a little bit racist, you know, that, that doesn't make you look good. So, no, this does not make... Hulk Hogan look good, and this makes the WWE sort of look bad, but, you know, it, it, obviously, even if they would have kept him, I don't think it would have hurt the WWE, but they don't want someone to have an image like that. The WWE is PG now, and let's be honest here, coming across as a racist is not PG television, and we all know even if, hell, even if the WWE was probably, um, Back in the Attitude Era, maybe they wouldn't have fired him. Maybe. Maybe. But at the same time, I can sort of see them firing him because coming off as a racist on national television, that never, ever makes you look good. For, for example, um, that guy who, um, who owned, I believe it was the Clippers. Yeah, I believe in the NBA. Um, I think his name was Donald Sterling or whatever the hell that guy's name was. That guy looked at bad. And the, um, the NBA, they didn't want nothing to do with this guy. Like, period. They didn't want nothing to do with him. So, clearly, the WWE don't want nothing to do with Hulk Hogan. Hulk Hogan made himself look really, really bad. Like, this makes him look bad. And it doesn't ruin his legacy or anything like that. I heard that WWE apparently removed his profile from WWE.com. Apparently, they took his name out of the Hall of Fame. Like, this made him look so damn bad that they had to fire him and just basically... Say that all way Hulk Hogan doesn't exist in the WWE like ever like that's what that's the way they're coming across here. But as far as this man, you know, because like I'm looking at his comments, I'm looking at him right now. I got him here on my on my TV, and some of the things that he has said is like stupid. It it just makes him look like a racist, stupid person. So when you say nigger, you know, some people might say, well. Nigger, and then there's the other way. There's nigga. Like I said, that there's the slang way of using the N word, and then there's the racist way of using the N word. He was saying the word nigger. He like like nigger, nigger. I don't I don't, I don't like these niggers, and you, you know, like that. And you know, even though like this McMahon, he said the N word. He didn't say nigger though. He said nigga. You know, the WWE they do a couple of. Racial things here and there, N nothing lately, but you know, this McMahon did a little segment with John Cena. He had said to John Cena, What's up, my nigga? And you know, uh, and um, what's his name? Uh, Booker T, he was in there, he comes out, he said, Tell me you didn't just say that. And hell, Booker T himself, he even told Hulk Hogan, He's like, Hulk Hogan, I'm coming for you, nigga. <laughs> did he come off as a racist? Of course not, probably because he was black, but at the same time, like I said, he was using it the 
slang way, like 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 in the streets. If I say, "Yo, man, what's up, nigga? What's up, man? How you doing?" Huh? You know, so so I'd be lying if I say I ain't, I've never used the N word. I've used the N word plenty of times before. You know, young black males. You know, what what, what our urban friends in our neighborhood, we use the N word plenty of times. I'm like, "Yeah, what's up, nigga? How you doing?" I'm like, "Oh man, this this is a bitch ass nigga." I'm like, "Oh man, this nigga whack as hell." You know, I, I've have I've I've used it before. So and I'm probably going to use it in the future, but. As far as, you no know, Hulk Hogan being a racist, you know, I don't know. I, I Like, I just don't know what he was thinking during this period of time. But I just wanted to, wanted to report that Hulk Hogan, yeah, fired from the WWE, um, coming across as a racist, man. As far as him being a racist, I just don't really know, even though he said, well, yeah, I'm a little bit of racist. So, this is What's on Jones. If you haven't done so, please subscribe to my channel. I'm out. Deuces.